yeah three bags worth of makeup and these are like heavy these are like hefty bags <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. So today I've got a really, really exciting haul to share with you. I have been shopping and that is no joke. I have been basically on a mission to get a whole bunch of makeup products that I have been wanting to get for a very long time. I've basically been inspired to go through my makeup collection. I'm going to give it a huge clear out and then I'm also going to change the way I store my makeup. So I kind of have done things in the wrong way around whereby I've gone out shopping first and I haven't actually cleared out my makeup, but that will definitely be happening. So I thought I would just pick up a few things that I really have been wanting for a long time and that I think are going to be really amazing additions to my makeup collection. So um, let's just jump right in because there is a lot of makeup to go through. I definitely got the most amount of makeup at Sephora. So let's just do this. Can you tell I'm excited? I'm so excited. So this is the Tartlet Amazonian Clay Matte Palette. And I don't think, this isn't new. There's also a second one that they have released as well. Um, but this is what it looks like. Um, amazing packaging. So that's what the palette looks like. It's all matte and you can see it's all um, beautiful. Let me just focus in on it. Yeah, there we go. All beautiful colors. I think it'll be nice to kind of just play around and experiment with these colors. Um, they are pretty neutral and they're all kind of cool tone neutral as well. The second thing that I picked up from Tarte was a blush and this is in the color Exposed. I don't really have any blushes this color, so that's kind of why I got it. I mean, I do have a lot of blushes, but um, nothing this color. This is a really gorgeous, soft kind of mauve color. A lot of my blushes are quite pink and this isn't really that pink. So um, yeah, this looks amazing. And I've also heard really good things about this particular color. So I'm excited to try that one. So I got two products from Becca and the first one is a highlighter. And this is of course the Pored highlighter in the color Champagne Pop by Jaclyn Hill and I am so excited to try this. This is what it looks like. It looks gorgeous and obviously there's been a lot of hype about this um, but I think for good reason it is really really beautiful and I don't actually have a highlighter like this. And then the second thing that I got from Becca um, is their backlight priming filter and again I don't actually have anything like this. I do have a, a few primers, but um, nothing that is like illuminating. So I am really excited to try this one out as well. So I've got two more things to show you from Sephora. Um, the next one is the hydrating primer from Laura Mercier. Um, I have heard amazing stuff about this primer. Um, and actually the lady at the counter said it is really, really good and she uses it. So it feels it doesn't really smell like anything, but it feels really, really nice on the skin. It kind of just feels like a really nice moisturizer, thin kind of moisturizer. Um, so I think this will be really nice to use um, maybe in the summer months um, when I'm wearing maybe a little bit less makeup. The next thing I got was a foundation and it is by It Cosmetics and it is their CC Plus color correcting full coverage cream foundation. Um, I actually kind of just stumbled across this because I was looking at the IT Cosmetics counter and there was a lady explaining this product to someone else and she was basically talking about how it color corrects and that it's really good coverage and she kind of sold it to me. I love that it's got a little pump on it. So I picked this up in the color light the consistency is really nice and it does look quite full coverage. So I am really excited to try that. I mean, I'm excited to try all of this. I should probably stop saying that. So I will move on to MAC now. Um, and I just picked up some lip products. So I got three lipsticks and three lip liners. 
and most of these products I had kind of been meaning to get for quite some time. So the three lipsticks that I picked up were Ruby Woo, Mare and Whirl. So a really, really nice vibrant red. I don't actually own a matte red lipstick. So this is like a really true red, I think with blue undertones. That's Ruby Woo. And I also picked up the matching lip liner. The next lipstick is Whirl. And again, this one is matte. Um, and it is quite a dark brown. This is actually what I'm wearing today. So I did have a little sneaky peek because I was just busting to put something on. So this is what I'm wearing today. I'll just top it up. It is, it is matte, but um, it's also quite moisturizing when you put it on. It doesn't feel super drying. Um, it is quite a dark brown and it's not my usual color, but I really like it. I think it's really pretty. So I picked Whirl up and then I also picked up the matching lip liner. And then last but not least, I got the lipstick in Mare. So this is a matte lipstick as well. Um, and it's like a really nice nude. It's a tiny bit lighter than Whirl. It's, um, I think it's a little bit more pink. It's actually showing up a little bit pink on camera, but it's really, really pretty. I think this would be nice for kind of every day. So I picked up this one, which is Mare. And I also picked up um, a lip liner that I've been meaning to get for a while. And that is in the color Saw. So yeah, that was everything from Mac. So the next store I went to was Mecca. And if you're not from Australia or not familiar with the store Mecca, it is really similar to Sephora, um, but it actually does stock different brands. Um, Sephora is quite, still quite new to Australia. It only came out, I believe, last year. So there's still quite a lot of hype around Sephora. Every time I go into the store, it is so busy. Um, and it is great, it does have great brands, but Mecca actually stock a few brands that Sephora don't. So they have Urban Decay, NARS, Hourglass. So basically brands that usually are in Sephora, um, but because it's so new, it's not there at the moment. So I think the things I got from Mecca are my favorite out of everything. The first thing I got was the Too Faced Chocolate Soleil Bronzer. It smells like chocolate. I mean, it's just beautiful. I know a lot of people love this bronzer. It's a really nice matte bronzer and it doesn't look too um, dark on camera, but it is quite a, this is the color medium. So it is relatively dark. I think it'll be really nice for a nice like contour. So, or just to kind of warm up your complexions. So the next thing I picked up was the Urban Decay Naked Skin Concealer, Weightless Concealer. This concealer is really, really popular with a lot of people. And last year I actually went out to buy it, but I could not find my color anywhere. So I think they've had like a big restock or something because they had quite a few colors to choose from, which I was happy about. And I got this in the shade light warm. And then last but not least, I think this is probably what I'm most excited for. Um, I picked up the Hourglass Ambient Lighting Powder in the shade Luminous Light. That is what it looks like. Let me zoom you in. So this isn't really a highlight. It's kind of like a face powder. You can use it all over your face and it basically just smooths everything out. All of the Hourglass products are just amazing. So as you can see, everything that I picked up is pretty much like a cult classic or um, just really, really well loved by a lot of people, great reviews. So I'm excited to kind of add this to my makeup collection. So as I mentioned earlier, I am planning on going through my makeup collection, getting rid of quite a lot of stuff, and I will be filming it. I think it will be a really fun video to share with you. So I'm going to declutter my makeup and then I'm also going to change the way I currently store my makeup. Um, and I will, I think maybe show you what the end product looks like. Maybe give you a little sneak peek into like my makeup collection. So if you are interested to see videos like that, definitely 
stay tuned or subscribe and they will be coming up very soon. So that is everything for this massive makeup haul. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up or subscribe and I will see you in my next video. Thanks for watching. Bye. Alright. Ooh, this looks nice. I just couldn't help myself. I need a tissue. Alright, I'm back. Take that off. So I got three lips. All of the, all of the, all of the.